As per the recent reports, the Mumbai Cyber Police has detained a woman, Shweta Singh, a key accused in the bully by app case from Uttarakhand, while a 21-year-old engineering student from Bangalore has already been arrested. The arrested student from Bangalore has been identified as Vishal Kumar and it is learnt that Mumbai Police is hunting for a third accused who is a male and is an accomplice of the arrested woman. The police are also investigating who is the mastermind of this entire gang and how many people are involved. During the interrogation of Vishal, information was received about a young woman in Rudrapur. After this, Maharashtra Police reached Rudrapur, Kotwali and arrested Shweta Singh's daughter Anantpal from Adarsh colony. As per the police sources, the detained woman is the main accused in the case while the police team is interrogating her. An official said that the women would be produced in a court for transit remand and then brought to Mumbai. The police has said that the main accused woman was handling three accounts linked to the bully by app. Co-accused Vishal Kumar opened the account in the name of Khalsa Supermassist. On 31st December, he changed the names of other accounts to those of Sikh names. While there is also a possibility that the Mumbai police may interrogate both the accused by sitting face to face, the magistrate has sent Vishal to police custody till 10th of January and has also allowed the police to conduct searches on his premises. According to the police, the women from Uttarakhand and Vishal know each other. They were friends on social media platforms like Facebook and Instagram. So, they kept in touch with each other while the police has also recovered two mobile phones from Vishal. On the other hand, Advocate D. Prajapati, who is the lawyer of accused Vishal Kumar, has said that his client has been sent to police custody till 10th of January while he is falsely implicated in the case. Police had filed an application to obtain a search warrant. Now, hundreds of Muslim women were listed for auction on the Bully Buy app after their photographs were tampered without permission. The cyber cell had registered an FIR against unidentified persons following a complaint that photographs of Muslim women were uploaded for auction on an app from the Gift Hub platform. This is the second time this has happened in less than a year. The app is like Sully Deals which led to a similar controversy in the previous year. The Delhi Police has sought information from the GitHub platform about the developer of the dodgy application on Monday morning, while at the same time, Twitter has been asked to block and remove related content on its platform. The police have also sought information from Twitter about the account handler who first tweeted about the app. Delhi Police has not yet arrested the Sully app creators, which acted similarly about six months ago. Earlier, Delhi Commission for Women Chief Swati Maliwal summoned the Deputy Commissioner of Police Cybercrime Cell on 3rd January and demanded the early arrest of the culprits. The Commission has also sought a report from the Delhi Police on the list of people arrested in the both the Sully deal and Bully Bai cases and actions taken. According to the FIR, the Bully Bai is an application where famous Muslim women were posted and bidden for them. Many people raised questions on this matter and complaints were registered, after which the cyber cell of Mumbai Police had registered against unknown people under sections 354D, 509, 500, 153A, 295A, 153B, section 67 of IT. A case was registered under the sections and an investigation was started.